Hi guys, it's Glenn here and in this video I'm going to show you how to install Chrome OS Flex. Chrome OS Flex is good for old device or laptop especially if you have 5 years old laptop and it's now running slow with this current OS, current Windows and application and I recommend you to use the Chrome OS Flex. Installing Chrome OS Flex it's very easy. You all need to have is go to your Chrome browser and go to extension just like what I did and as you can see here just type Chrome OS or Chrome Recovery Utility but since I already have the Chromebook Recovery Utility I will just show you where I get so all you have to do is go to this Chrome Web Store and type Chromebook Utility Recovery. Once you see it, just click this Chrome Recovery Utility and you will see here install or add extension. Since I already have it, the options here is to remove. Now to open that extension or the Chromebook Recovery Utility, just go to extension menu and now you are here click get started and type here or select model go to chrome os google chrome os plex just click this and chrome os developer so now just click continue and find your storage or flash drive make it sure that you choose the right storage because it might delete the files that you need in other storage so after that just click continue this may take long it will be around 15 to 20 minutes depends on your device so you have to be ready when doing this just make sure you are not in hurry since it may take long so after that just click continue and this will ask you some permission to click or install and this will download again and this part will be the longest part so you have to be patient in waiting to create a recovery image this will take 15 to 20 minutes again so you have to wait it and after that this will show you this windows it means that you are successfully created a Chrome OS Plex bootable device. You can now try or install this to your AMD and Intel old device. Now we will try it to install an our old laptop. And what I'm going to do is to restart this device. This is a 2016 version of laptop. And once you restart your laptop, just click F2 if you're using ASOS and depends on your device. It could be delete or F12 but since this is an ASOS, I will be using F2. And as you can see here, go to the bit menu. We have now an UFI, Kingston Data Traveler which is our USB stick. Now we will choose this as a boot menu. We will just click this. Sorry for the shaky hand. And now it's booting up. We will just try to use this or use it without internet and account or guest account since I will be showing you also to install it in my AMD device. By the way, this laptop is Intel device. So just click get started and click try it first so we will just try it first we will not be installing it since my laptop is already have chrome os since it's triple boot with os linux and windows now click next and log in your wi-fi password and after that this will ask you to log in your google account but we will not be doing that since we will only be using the 
guest account so here just click accept terms and condition and in this part just click browse as guest so now we are in the chrome os flex but since we use browse as guest it will be limited and now i'm gonna show you in my md device of course the process are the same but this time i will show you that you will be you will log in your gmail account so this will ask you to sync your account from other device that using google like your phone and tablet just click agree to all settings here and let's just pass forward but of course you have to read what will be the choices so you can customize your settings and now we are ready in our from os so here you will see that there are lots of application compared to the guest account and we will check what are the applications here so these are the apps pre-installed in this chrome os so most of the apps are google apps so that's all for today and i hope that you learned something in this video by the way chrome os flex has no play store compared to other chrome os version since it is built for the light use of your old device if you have some question please don't hesitate to drop your comment i will be glad to answer you if you find difficult or you want to clarify something in this video so that's all see you in my next video goodbye and god bless